learned quite a bit. You must be so proud. First Test match win at Newlands by an Indian team. Yeah, I mean, obviously, uh, a great feat, uh, you know. Uh, but, you know, having said that in Centurion, that uh, we got to learn from whatever mistakes we made in, in that Test match, uh, we came back pretty well, especially, um, you know, our bowlers. Even though the conditions were tough for the batters, you got still got to put the ball in the right areas, have some plans behind it. And we really had some plans as to what we wanted to do. Um, and, yeah, but the boys got rewarded for it. Uh, and yeah, we applied ourselves, uh, we bat really, batted really well to get a 100 run lead. Um, uh, not pleasing to see the last six wickets, but uh, again, you know, the first uh, six batters, the way they batted, we knew that it's going to be a short game. Uh, we knew every run matters. Uh, to get that first inning, uh, first inning lead was very important for us. You took the match by the scruff of the neck in the, that first inning, South Africa 55 all out. How special was Mohamed Siraj? Yeah, absolutely. Very, very special. Uh, something that you don't get to see quite often. Uh, a smell like that. Uh, you know, we spoke about uh, keeping things very simple uh, because the pitch will do the rest for us and that's exactly what happened. Uh, we kept it very simple, put the ball in the right areas and we saw pitch uh, did the rest. Uh, again, you still got to come and do it. Uh, you know, so a lot of credit to Siraj, Bumra and Mukesh and uh, Prasid as well to uh, support them uh, in whatever way they could. India has been touring South Africa for over 30 years and uh, test results haven't gone your way too often. It's the first time you're winning here at Newlands, but also only the second time for a drawn series. I know how much you wanted to breach this final frontier, but what um, what do you take out of the series, knowing that you were able to share the spoils? No, look, uh, whenever we, you come to this part of the world, it's always challenging. Uh, we do understand that. But in the last four or five years, uh, we've become a very good travelling team. Uh, we've played a lot of good cricket outside India, uh, and we take a lot of pride in performance outside India, uh, you know, uh, and uh, yeah, I mean, we would have liked to win the series, um, but again, uh, you cannot, um, you know, get everything, uh, we, we do understand that as well, uh, South Africa is a great team and we, they always challenge us, uh, that's probably the reason we have not won a series because they are such a good cricket team, uh, you know, but for us to come out here and win like this uh, gives us a lot of confidence, uh, you know, that we can perform under any condition. And uh, yeah, we can take a lot of pride in this performance. Special moment with a handover to Dean Alger. A word for him as he retires from international cricket? Oh, well, I mean, such a important player for South Africa. What he has done uh, through, through his career for South Africa. I mean, there are only few who have done that. Um, very, very gritty. We all know that, uh, you know. And his wicket, we only spoke about uh, how we want to get him out quickly. Um, and yeah, we, we, we do understand, you know, uh, for someone to have a career like that, uh, we do appreciate it all of us, uh, you know, in our team, appreciate what he's done uh, for South Africa. But yeah, I would just like to wish him the best uh, for the future uh, because you don't get to see a player like that every every now and then. So, uh, brilliant career. Uh, best wishes ahead. Congratulations.